About eight months ago, I was going through mental health, like huge mental problems, and I created this artwork to symbolize what I was going through. And then recently, I discovered it, and I thought to share. So this is the artwork right here, and I added all the four things that were going on in my mind at the time. I added what if, I added heartbreak, I added regret, and I added I added a uh, failure. Honestly, these are just some of the things that people tend to think about when they're going through anxiety and tough times in life. And so let's talk about failure for first. So failure, everybody's going to fail. You are going to fail. I'm going to fail. It's going to happen to me. It's going to happen to you. It's going to happen to everybody. But instead of just sitting right there, thinking about what would have went right, just think about all the good things that happen that are actually happening in your life and honestly there's this quote by michael jordan that says i can accept failure because everybody fails at something but i cannot accept not trying so that's basic because basically um if you think about it i'd rather fail than regret something than regret not trying something you know what i'm saying like i'd rather give it my shot and then just fail rather than not giving it a shot as not giving it a shot at all because if i fail this time i'm not starting from scratch this time i'm starting from experience and i'm coming back 10 times harder than i ever started so don't uh don't wrap your head around the whole failure thing that like it's just happening to you in the world instead pick your head up keep going you're stronger like you are literally capable of any fucking thing you put your mind to like i'm not just saying that because i'm just saying it <laughs> i really fucking mean that and i hope everybody out there is good with mental health and stuff and uh yeah keep going i also described the words what if in the drawing with a question mark because it's a question that we ask ourselves most of the time about the future oh what's gonna go right what's gonna go wrong and we get anxious and you know we, we just think about the future what if this what if that what if that and i'm here to tell you like honestly um i'm a type of guy who doesn't believe there's such a thing about we are destined for something like i don't think there's such a thing as being destined for something as in like you're just destined to be this or that i but i do believe in fate see that's the thing that's the difference between the two when you are destined for something it means you can't change anything it means you 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 be what you are destined for am i making sense but while with fate with fate you can change anything every day and i feel like that's the definition of life you can make a decision now and change tomorrow you can make a decision now that will change it like i can make five decisions right now that will change my life five times tomorrow that's what i'm talking about i can choose to be a person i want to be tomorrow and i will be that person so that's the thing about fate and that's what i believe in i just hope i'm making sense if i'm not um i don't know i just i hope i'm making sense and another detail if you can look at my artwork you can see with i, I drew a figure and the figure was like weeping in tears and you can see you can see right above her head where the brain is that where the head is you can actually see some like arrows going back and forth that means though that's overthinking that's literally you just processing those thoughts what people say about you or whatever and here's the thing about what people say people will always be people they will always put some people just are like that you know they 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 struggle with themselves to a point where it's like they don't accept who they are so they they release that energy and bad vibes on other people by making it seem like those other people are uh are, are the bad ones you know what i'm saying like imagine a person living their life like imagine you for example you're living your life you're making your own decisions and then there's this random person who comes along and then tells you you shouldn't be living this way this and this and that you shouldn't be doing this with your life it's crazy to me because if you think about it bro who cares we're all gonna freaking die one day 
and it's just up to us to live to our fullest potential and I, I don't want to get it too 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 salty too 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 whatever with with the whole um we're all gonna die one day thing but like think about it think how crazy it is if you die right fucking now what would you go down would you go down after taking that last breath saying i'm so happy i lived my life no just think about it for a second when you are in that deathbed do you tell yourself i lived the life i wanted to live and now it's over you don't want to be sitting on that deathbed wishing you would have done something different you know and about two days ago i saw i saw like a like a like a tiktok by morgan freeman or whatever he was like you're born with a gift it's either that or you you get good at something along the way but what you're good at you you don't betray even if it's for other people i don't care what your parents told you who you should be i don't care if because that's the thing about society society tells us to be who we should be instead of embracing us embracing our full potential society just pins things on us and tells it and tell us at this age you're supposed to go to school at this age you're supposed to have babies get married babies work 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 retire whatever it's so freaking rigged same as the school uh, the entire school system or whatever i mean bro i might regret <laughs> saying some stuff in this video but you know i just that's the thing i don't care like i said it's all about fate not destiny fate